where they are bringing a Major League Baseball team to Portland. Finally today, a major <laughs> announcement and drawings of a new stadium. Adam joined us now with coverage. What a big day for local sports. Yeah, a, a, an enormous day, you guys. Yeah, with the Portland Diamond Project announcing that they have picked their plot of land and the stadium, stadium renderings of where they hope to build that. So let's head out to Terminal 2 right now in Northwest Portland. That's where we find our own A.J. McCord. And A.J., it's a very real possibility that right now you are standing near home plate. Totally. Isn't that wild that in like five to six years, this view behind me could be totally different. Now I know it's dark, so you can't see, but just over my left shoulder is where Mount Hood would be. So I think we're standing right along the third baseline right about now. It's a little hard still to imagine, but these renderings today make it so much easier. And like you mentioned, this is a huge day because not only did the Portland Diamond Project announce where they want to build the stadium, but they announced their agreement with the Port of Portland to build the stadium there. That is a huge step step to have those two on the same page about this project. So if you take a look at these pictures, there's a lot going on already with what they've released to the stadium. I'm told there's a lot more details they already have and will release later. But you see a little open area by the outfield. They've got a roof that would cover some of the seats if we did get that occasional baseball season rain shower. And the way it's oriented, you could get views of Mount Hood from the right field line. And of course, one of the parts we know Russell Wilson and Sierra fell in love with is the fact that this is on the water. They love that that waterfront property right along the Willamette. I spoke with Mike Barrett, the managing director of the Portland Diamond Project, about how big of a step this is, but also what comes next. The next step now is we continue our, our talks with uh, all of those in Major League Baseball in and around, and we will be at uh, MLB winter meetings in Las Vegas coming up uh, in December on the 10th. Um, Craig and I, uh, as the managing director, will be down there and we'll continue our, our discussions. And a lot of those, of course, we can't talk publicly about, but I can say that we will be there. And we're excited now to have this day behind us because uh, you can throw stuff out there and you can show that you're dreaming, but until you actually um, have land, uh, that, that's, that's a huge hurdle. So, of course, now we're going to wait to see kind of hear more, I guess you could say, about those December 10th meetings. And I asked Mike, how much more clout does this give them to have this announcement out of the way in the open before those meetings? And he said it gives them quite a bit because, like he said, now they're not just dreamers. They don't just have money. They have a place in Portland that this could feasibly work out. So, Adam, this is a big step, and it's pretty wild to think that five or six years from now I could report be reporting to you live from Portland's Major League Baseball Stadium. So a lot of fun news today and I'm sure a lot more to come. But now live from hopefully the future site of Major League Baseball in Portland, I'll send it back to you.